Excuse me, could you tell us a story about your scootering experience at Davis? Uh. <laughs> hey Aggies, it's Ellie and welcome back to Dear Davis Diary. It's officially spooky season, so we're gonna jump into this season with some Davis horror bike stories. actually the spot that during my fall quarter my freshman year I got into a bike accident so I was coming back from a midterm and I was coming this way and then this guy was turning in the bike rack so I'm going straight and then he turned into me and then our bikes collided and I actually have like a huge like a really it's a lot lighter now but I have like a big scar on my leg so that was like a couple years ago but I'll also say be very careful when you're biking and be careful when you're turning into the bike racks let's get ready to meet some of my fellow bike crashers are you ready? Let's go. Do you have any stories of any bike accidents? If so, what happened? Yeah, uh, my, I ran into someone with my bike once because my brake wasn't working. When I was a freshman, actually, some girl got into a major accident and their hand was just bleeding and there were emergency vehicles all across there and there was just two destroyed bikes in front of there as well. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. So there's even an ambulance there? Yeah. Seen a couple accidents, just like two, it's fine. But so far, so good. The DC in Segundo, like where the a tunnel is, I've seen like a lot of collisions there because it's like people go one direction and people go underneath. So I've seen like a few times where people get too close to each other. And do you guys have any like annoyances or just like bike stories? Um, we could both say that definitely the squirrels at UC Davis are really scary. Um, <laughs> the both of us experienced it. Like I would make eye contact with the squirrel hoping they wouldn't come right in front of me. And next thing you know, they zoom right at me. So it was very scary. Yeah, no, that is scary. I had a friend who accidentally concussed a squirrel. <laughs> like, it ran through her wheel. Oh my gosh. And then it ran up the tree and fell off and died. <laughs> That, wow. wow. <laughs> yeah, so guys, be yeah. careful of those squirrels, okay? <laughs> yeah, dangerous. What is your biking experience at Davis? Um, biking at Davis is very hectic. Um, there's a lot of bikes, and especially during like peak class start times or end times, it's very chaotic, lots of bikes, kind of stressful. I know not everyone knows what they're doing and a lot of people make bad decisions, so I just try to bike cautiously for sure. So as a pedestrian, how has it been navigating Davis with so many bikers? Uh, it's not really a problem. A lot of the bikers are kind of curious because they kind of stop when they see a bunch of walkers like going through crosswalks, so they kind of stop for us. Vinny, have, how is your biking experience at Davis? Oh wow, that's crazy. Like You must be such an amazing biker because you can juggle and bike. Everybody can juggle. Two, one. Oh, Dude. I'm a soccer player, so I don't really do things with my hands. Oh yeah. Thank, oh yeah. Wow. Thank you. Thank you very much. Wow. Thank you. That was really fun. Have you ever been in a bike accident before? The gear on my bike snapped off, and I was kind of like free coasting, like down the bike path, and this other biker that was trying to make a turn um, didn't stop in time, and we collided, and the bike handle to my bike kind of like broke. Uh, so I ended up missing that final. I think I was carrying too many things and I just lost control of my bike and I just like fell to the side of the road. Uh, I did run to the trash can. Um, the trash can was right in front of me. I was turned to the left and I looked over and I crashed into it. Wait, where was this? And was this like a little one or is it like a dumpster? <laughs> uh, if you've seen the ones in the residential areas, it's like one of the really big ones and I just boom. <laughs> Oh my gosh, are you okay? Uh, I'm okay. Number one advice is that you don't just get into the roundabout. As soon as uh, you arrive at the roundabout, you would let the people in the roundabout exit first, then you can go enter. Take it slow, don't rush into anything. Learn how to like navigate the space first before like trying to rush mm -hmm. as everyone else, yeah. Well, keep doing what you're doing, <laughs> I guess. Also kind of random because you have like the most adorable Pomeranian. Do you ever bring your, your puppy when you're biking or like in your basket? Maybe, yeah, but sometimes he just move and no, see, you see it's uncontrollable. And, yeah. See, he'd be the, want to be the one who's biking. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me, could you tell us a story about your scootering experience at Davis? Uh, can I just study here? Oh. Okay, never mind. <laughs> like, oh, <laughs> hi, 
excuse me, excuse me, would you be willing to be interviewed about Gipu? No. <laughs> oh, dang it. Well, hearing about those bike crashes certainly got me spooked. If you got some scarier stories, make sure to leave it below in the comments. Thanks for reading over my shoulder at Dear Davis Diary. I'm Ellie, and stay tuned for all things Aggie.